Do you understand why people are now questioning your ability to be our senator from the state of Pennsylvania because of moments like that? No, I, I, I believe that, that my support of fracking has always been, been one that, uh, in, in the past, uh, it was some of the environmental uh, concerns. And after Pennsylvania enacted some of the, the strongest environmental uh, regulations, uh, then it became really uh, easy to, to fully support fracking. And based on where I live right now, I live right across the street from the, the steel mill. E you know, even back in 2017, I supported, they wanted to frack their own energy. And I support that to make them more competitive. So I, I support fracking. And uh, now that those environmental regulations were, uh, were uh, enacted, then I fully support fracking. Uh, back to the original question about when the, the, you struggle to answer the question during the debate, do you understand why people are concerned about your ability to be our senator? I, I, I believe, uh, I mean, I, I certainly, the, during, during the debate, I, I mean, I, I was very much aware that I, I had a stroke and I was in the position to show up, and I, and I did. And, uh, you know, I did get knocked down by the stroke, but I, I got back up and uh, just showed up. It seems to me, though, that you still have a, a... It seems like the elephant in the room is even bigger now, uh, you know, after that debate. And with only a week to go before the election, it seems like you have a high hill to climb with such a short amount of time uh, before the election to prove that you can be the senator from the state of Pennsylvania. How are you going to prove it to all of us uh, in the next few days? Well, we're we're going to be spending, you know, this, the days going all across Pennsylvania, uh, and we're having uh, events, you know, whether it's in Erie, whether it's in, in State College, or whether it's in Philadelphia, whether it's on Pittsburgh, going out and making making our argument uh, all across Pennsylvania.